Oculus Quest 2, our honest review. Oculus Quest 2, or Meta Quest 2, a VR or virtual reality headset created by Meta Platforms, was revealed in September 2020 and launched in October of the same year. Since then, it has maintained quite the buzz in the market, especially with virtual reality considered the next best thing. To change how technology is preserved and more and more people wanting to use it, well, according to us, Oculus Quest 2 is not only maintaining the bar but also raising it. This is because the quality of the headset is quite impressive and is one of the best available in the market right now. If you want to know why we're raving about it, watch the video by MetaHub till the end because we'll talk about the headset's details and give you an unfiltered review. Here we begin. The Oculus Quest 2 upgrades almost everything from the previous version at an even more reasonable price rendering it the best VR headset for both beginners and experienced or professional users. There are several pros to the newly launched headset. It does not require cables and has a sharp display, along with a powerful processor and precise motion tracking. In addition, it has an optional PC teetering available with an accessory cable. Let's start with the Steamline design. The Quest 2 is more lightweight and smaller than its previous version, the Oculus Go. It weighs approximately 501.78 grams or 17.7 ounces and measures a height of 4.0 inches, a width of 7.5 inches, and a depth of 5.6 inches without the strap. The soft plastic covering of the virtual reality headset is white, and the foam eye mask is behind it. The plastic is black in, in color and gives good contrast. The faceplate presents in front is almost bare if not for the four cameras used for position tracking present along the edge. On the left side is a USB-C port on the headset along with the headphone jack, and on the right side it has an indicator LED and power button. Underneath the headset is a volume rocker, in addition to two pinhole microphones. The eye mask easily pulls out so you can adjust the positions of the lenses or insert a spectator that lifts the headset slightly away from your face to accommodate glasses. However, even with the separator, glasses can make the experience feel awkward if you have large frames. The headband of the headset is an elastic strap with three points that spans across plastic arms and is capable of providing scanity in upwards and downwards directions. The arms house speakers that pipe sound into your ears without headphones. The strap in the top is connected to the headset via hook and loop or velcro fasteners, giving the user the flexibility to adjust and modify the fitting of the headset against their face. Then the straps present on the side are joined with the help of two sliding clips made of plastic at the back of the Quest. Adjusting the headset is simple and fast with the built-in strap. However, it doesn't procure a fit with great security and sometimes shifts if the user moves their head prominently or sharply. But even this can be fixed if the user replaces it with the Elite Strap of Quest 2, an accessory available for $49. And it also procures a more solid and secure fit the Elite Strap has a piece of plastic strap like a ring that holds back the user's head. The add-on accessory has a ratcheting wheel to keep the strap hooked. The Quest 2 headset. The handle is bigger than before and provides a relaxed bare spot so that the user can rest their thumb when they are not actively utilizing the two face buttons or analog stick. The fresh design of the controllers makes them feel a little thick in the user's hand and 
easier to hold tightly. And it just keeps getting better. For example, you won't have to worry about the battery door sliding off for an intense gaming session, since it is like, less likely to do so. Simply put, the new feature cannot be considered a drastic redesign, but the small tweaks made the controller feel adequate overall. Oculus Quest 2 Controllers The user can conveniently use the Meta or Oculus Quest 2 with their bare hands as the headset has a head tracking feature available, which was previously only available as a beta feature in the Oculus Quest Go. The headset's camera follows the orientation, shape, and position of the user's hands. Once this feature is on, the user can move their hands voluntarily in front of the Quest 2 to regulate the in-system pointer. When the user pinches their forefinger together for a minute, it administers as a click. In the meanwhile, holding and pinching functions as drag and then click. Powerful Hardware MetaQuest 2 or Oculus Quest 2 has a Snapdragon 835 derived processor Snapdragon XR2, which is a noteworthy modification over its predecessor, model Quantrum Snapdragon 835 chip. This impressive factor unlocks a substantial performance improvement over the initial MetaQuest particularly while the 2GB of RAM in addition for an air gate of 6GB. The headset was launched initially with a storage of 64GB and it couldn't be expanded, but now it is available with a standard 128GB. One of the great transformative uses of any VR device for or related to creativity, design, and art, being lundergated with virtual reality enables you to create in 3D by utilizing natural information so that the outputs accurately match the actions of both your body and hands. Exemplifying perspective is not an imagination anymore. You can get any of your 3D ideas directly from your mind into the 3D space very easily. So if you have purchased the Oculus Quest 2 recently or are thinking about purchasing it and want to use it to skip through the realm of VR design and art, some of the best apps you can use are Gravity Sketch, Tilt Brush, and King Spray Graffiti. So basically, with the introduction of Oculus Quest 2, we better get to the nitty gritty of the best version. The initial Quest VR headset was a great step in making virtual reality more relevant in today's time with its controller tracking, strong performance 6DOF head and standalone functionality, an exceptional feature. But with Quest 2, we get an upgrade in almost all aspects. It delivers so many better features such as sharper display, a faster processor, and a more lightweight design that you will receive at an even more accessible rate than the first version. Pricing The Oculus Quest 2 is priced at $400 for a 128GB model and a 256GB model. The cost is $499 and the cherry on top is that some includes the best VR package, which compresses everything at one piece. There is also the option of getting additional accessories that fluctuate more extended operation duration and PC teetering. There is one more thing. Sure, whatever money you will spend on the Quest 2 is going to be worth it. Are you thinking about buying the Oculus Quest 2 or have you already purchased it? Drop your answers in the comments section below. That's it for today, but we'll be back soon with more such videos. So subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to always get updates. If you like today's content, then remember to press the thumbs up and share button. Take care and thanks for watching.